Hey friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix Arena Breakout Infinite not launching, won't launch, crashing, crashes to desktop, crashing at a startup, freezing problem, not loading or stuck on loading screen or black screen problem on PC. And this is for the Steam users. So without wasting any time, here follow the fixes. The first fix is to simply restart your PC. So click on this Windows icon then click on power menu and then click restart and after your device restart then you can launch the game and check fix 2 is to turn off MSI after burner overlay so try to turn off MSI after burner overlay and then you can launch the game and check this has solved the issue for many players so I hope this will work for you as well fix 3 is to make sure your account is active so make sure your account is active you can only play the game once your account is active on the arena breakout infinite launcher otherwise not let you to launch the game fix 4 is to delete arena breakout infinite save game folder now please take a note you will lose all the save game progress so keep the backup of this folder to desktop first so what you have to do open the file explorer go to this pc open c drive open users folder open your username folder then open app data folder if you don't see app data folder then click on this view icon then select so and then check mark hidden items then open app data folder then open local folder now copy this ab infinite folder and paste it to desktop first and then right click on this ab infinite folder and select delete to delete it once it is deleted then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not fix 5 is to modify the game launch options so open steam Go to library, right click on arena breakout infinite, select properties. Now in the launch option type minus DX11, close the tab and then launch the game and check. If that doesn't work, then again go to properties, this time type minus DX12, close the tab, now launch the game and check. If it's still not working, again go to properties, remove this launch option command, close it and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video. Fix 6 is to run the game as an administrator. To do this, go to Steam, right click on Arena Breakout Infinite and select Manage Browse Local Files. It will take you to the game installation folder. Now open Launcher folder. Now double click this Arena Breakout Infinite Launcher exe file and see if this works or not. If not, then right click on it and then click on Run as an administrator and then check if it's still not working then go back open ab infinite folder open binaries folder open win64 folder scroll down now double click this ua game exe file and check if this work or not if not then right click on this ua game exe file go to properties go to compatibility tab then tick mark run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then launch the game and check if that doesn't work then this time select run this program in compatibility mode for windows 8 hit apply ok and then launch the game and check if it's still not working then from the drop down select windows 7 hit apply ok and then launch the game and check if it's still not working then select disable full screen optimization hit apply ok and then launch the game and check now if it's still not working then untick all this option from the compatible tab and then hit apply ok and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video now windows security users allow the game exe file to the control folder access and firewalls so to do this type windows security in windows search and open it click on virus and threat protection scroll down click on manage ransomware protection click on allow an app through control folder access click yes to allow then click on add an allowed app then click on browse all apps now go to the game installation folder open ab infinite folder open launcher folder select arena breakout infinite launcher and then click on open to add it to the list again click on add an allowed app browse all apps go back open ab infinite folder open binaries folder open win64 folder select ua game exe file and then click on open to add it to the list now go back click on firewall and network protection 
click allow an app through firewall click on change settings click on allow another app then click on browse now go to the game installation folder open launcher folder select arena record infinite launcher and click open now click on add it is already added in my case again click on allow another app click on browse browse to game installation folder open ab infinite folder open binaries folder open win64 folder select ua game exe file and click open to add it then click on add after adding it make sure both private and public is tick marked and then click on ok to save changes now you can launch the game and check now if you are using any third party antivirus program such as komodo avast casper sky avg maccafe norton bitdefender then allow the game exe file to your antivirus program as well or you can also turn off your antivirus program for a while then launch the game and check and later on you can turn on your antivirus program fix 8 is to run the game on dedicated graphics card driver to do so in windows search type graphics settings and open it click on add desktop app now go to the game installation folder open ab infinite folder Open launcher folder select arena breakout infinite launcher click on add expand it and next to GPU preference select high performance now again click on add desktop app go back click on AB infinite folder open binaries folder open win64 folder select UA game exe file and click on add after adding it expand it and next to GP preference select the drop down and select high performance and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. Nine solution is to perform a clean installation of graphic card driver. But before performing a clean installation, first update your graphic card to the latest version and then check. If that doesn't work, then perform a clean installation of graphic card driver. If you are having NVIDIA graphic card driver then go to NVIDIA website. If you are having AMD graphic card driver then go to AMD website. And if you are having Intel graphic card driver then go to the Intel website. The links are provided in the video description. So I am showing the example of NVIDIA graphic card driver. So go to this NVIDIA website. And once you are on the NVIDIA website, select your version of graphic card driver from here. Select Windows operating system and then click on find. The latest version will be on the top. So this is the version 581.29 and you have to install this one GeForce Game Ready Driver. So click on view. Then click on download. And once this exe file get downloaded, then run the downloaded exe file and select yes to allow and then click OK. You will see this screen. Click on agree and continue. Then select custom advanced option and then click on next then tick mark perform a clean installation box then click on next and after the clean installation of graphic card driver is done restart your pc and then launch the game and check fix 10 verify the game files so open steam go to library right click on arena breakout infinite select properties go to install files tab then click on verify integrity of game files and after the verification completes then you can launch the game and check or you can also repair the game files via launcher and then check. 11 solution is to install Visual C++ files. So go to this Microsoft official website. Link is given in the video description. Now I scroll down. Now download both x86 and x64 version. Download both the version. Now you have to install both x64 and x86 version. So click on x64. Now if you see repair option then click on repair, if you see install option then click on install and install it. Then click on x86 version. Now if you see repair option then click on repair and if you see install option then click on install and then install it. And after the installation of both the version x86 and x64 you can then launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. 12 solution is to disable overlay. So disable game overlay in steam. So open steam. Go to library, right click on arena breakout infinite, select properties. Now turn off this option, enable the steam overlay while in game, turn it off. 
disable discord overlay launch discord on your pc then click on gear icon in the app bottom left corner click on game overlay on the left panel and then toggle off the enable in game overlay disable nvidia overlay open nvidia geforce experience settings general turn off in game overlay similarly disable overlay in all apps or close all other overlay apps such as geforce experience nvidia shadow play overlay amd overlay and then you can launch the game and check 13th solution is to close conflicting or unnecessary programs so disconnect external usb drive mouse disconnect additional joystick controllers multiple monitor connected to pc unplug the logitech or thrustmaster racing wheel and the task for afterburner riva tuner hw info razer synapse or msi dragon center from task manager close all of your tabs to free up ram and then relaunch the game and check 14th solution is to update windows so click on windows icon go to settings on the left click on windows update then click on check for updates and if there are any updates available then download and install them and then you can launch the game and check 15th solution is to uninstall and reinstall the game so simply uninstall the game from your pc and then restart your pc and then reinstall arena breakout infinite game in the c drive ssd drive if already installed in c drive then try installing it to another external ssd drive and then you can launch the game and check so that's all for this video if this video helped you then please like and share this video and also subscribe to my youtube channel to get the latest updates thank you